that after people see this film that they'll be uh, inspired and moved to try and address the really important issues that are raised in this film. I think the film is shocking in many ways because it shows how recent these atrocities are. I really agree with the Brits who are now really wanting to add casteism into their Human Rights Act. I think after seeing this film, I see a real need in New Zealand for a law change. I think it's particularly appropriate that a Chief Human Rights Commissioner is at this premiere because this film is fundamentally about human rights. <laughs> Constitutions and laws are important, but they're never enough. And it's actually what happens day to day, how we deal with each other, that makes the difference between whether human rights are realised. The caste system is something that you still learn about, but it feels so distant and unreal. And I think your film adds a layer of reality that we need in New Zealand. They definitely take in the suitcase their caste system. Starting in the late 1800s, untouchables migrated from India to the West. I think it's put paid to any denial that there is a problem, that there is an issue, that there is discrimination, and it's alive and well in the 21st century. Cases have been brought to me uh, in a generic way about discrimination of that nature occurring here. One of the, the biggest messages within this film is that we need to raise awareness of, of issues of discrimination, whether they be more apparent or, or more subtle. People in the West assume that the caste system is decreasing or, or diminishing in its um, impact on people's lives, but actually it's quite to the contrary. And I love the way the film traced the history of casteism right, right back over the centuries and told us how really it's evolved today. So it was, yeah, it was absolutely mind-blowing, fantastic film. One of the strengths of this film is I think it does actually uh, present a really strong and compelling uh, story and it actually provides very clearly the evidence.